If you want to build muscle faster using peptides, the more powerful option probably isn't the one that you should start with. In this video, I'm going to show you which stack to use for long-term gains and when the more aggressive option makes sense. Now, you've probably heard of IGF-1 LR3. This is the most powerful peptide for muscle growth. So naturally, that's where you'd want to start. IGF-1 LR3 is incredibly powerful, but it can only be used for about four to six weeks before your receptors start to desensitize. Then you need to take months off of it. So this can be a short-term acceleration tool, but not a long-term foundation for building results. But CJC1295 and ipermorelin work differently. They work with your body's natural hormone production system, which means that you can use them for much longer. This makes your results more stable, more consistent, and have a lower impact to your natural production. Now here's what makes that combination work. Your pituitary gland releases growth hormone, which then signals your liver to produce IGF-1. IGF-1 is the hormone that actually supports that muscle tissue growth and recovery. And your body is using two signals to release that growth hormone. The first is GHRH, which stands for growth hormone releasing hormone. This comes from your brain and tells your pituitary gland when to release that growth hormone. The second is ghrelin, which is a hormone that comes from your gut when you're hungry and tells your pituitary how much to release. CJC1295 mimics GHRH and ipomorelin mimics ghrelin. And when you combine them, you're hitting both pathways at once. And that's exactly why they create two to three times more growth hormone release than using either one alone. IGF-1 LR3 works, but it bypasses this entire system. And now what you're doing is just introducing that hormone directly. That's very powerful, but your body's going to adapt to that very quickly. With CJC-1295 and ipomorelin, you're just amplifying the natural process. So your body's going to tolerate it for much longer. So if you want to build muscle more efficiently and create sustainable long-term gains, try adding CJC-1295 and ipomorelin to your stack. And when you do, you should start seeing better recovery and sleep, and your body composition is going to start changing within the first month or so. Now, if you want to learn a little bit more about specific peptides, including detailed protocols, dosing, cycling, and sourcing information, I actually have a free community where I break all of that down. It's free to join, and all you have to do to get an invite is just comment the word school with a K below, and I'll send you a link to join. I hope this video helps, and I'll see you on the next one.